One, oh, two, stop. Three, nice, excellent. Oh, what? Oh my God. what if Meteo El Drago had a second evolution during the second season of Beyblade? Let's say it had another one before El Drago Destroy. And so let's create it. So Meteo El Drago actually has some other existing current customizations for its energy ring. This energy ring is Ultimate Meteo El Drago Assault. Unlike the other energy ring, this one has no rubber and it has a lot more hard plastic onto it. And because of that, this Beyblade should have a lot more attack power. And for the spin track, we're going to be exchanging the left wing 105 for the down force 105 spin track. Unlike the other spin track, this one actually has four wings and it's meant to add extra weight and push air upwards. And for the tip, we're actually going to be exchanging the left flat tip for the left rubber flat tip. They are practically the same design, but the left rubber flat one is made out of rubber. And don't be mistaken, this tip is not the one that Galaxy Pegasus has. This one is actually meant for left spinning Beyblades. And here's the final results. We have Ultimate Meteo El Drago Assault DF105 LRF. This should be a really good left spin attacker because of the left rubber flat tip. With enough speed, it can gather up enough power to get some really good knockouts. So now let's run out some test battles and see how it is. I think because since it's a left spinning Beyblade, whenever it does hit another right spinning Beyblade, it doesn't get its power drained from it. Unlike two right spinning Beyblades going against each other, every time they get hit, their spin slowly gets depleted. And this pretty much goes both ways with the right spinning Beyblade and the left spinning Beyblade going against each other. Except for this time, Meteo El Drago's main goal is just to knock you out. Because Meteo El Drago is a left spinning Beyblade, whenever it does hit another right spinning Beyblade, its stamina does not get as depleted as if it were to be right spinning. So now this lets Meteo El Drago actually land a lot more hits that could lead out to a potential KO. By the way, this match is against yesterday's evolution, Counter Ares, which I just uploaded a full battle on my YouTube. Let me know in the comments if you have any other suggestions.